Hi everybody, it's Charlotte, and we're up at the barn getting ready to test our voltage meter on Tommy's horse. A voltage meter is a piece of equipment, a digital piece of equipment that we can use to touch the voltage in a plug, which is probably what the intention is, but I am using it as I've seen on YouTube by other people to test the voltage on people and on horses to help us find out does grounding actually bring our voltage down? What? So we want to see what our voltage is before grounding, when the horse first comes in from the paddock, and then we're going to put our grounding stuff on him and see if that voltage comes down. So our horse today to use is Waldo, and it is Tommy's horse that he does dressage on and I use for the thoroughbred makeover in 2017 and he is getting ready to go to a lesson. So we're gonna test all this stuff really quick. All right, so we now have our grounding meter here, our voltage detector and it is, when we're doing nothing, it's reading so pretty zero. Now I'm gonna touch the horse and whoa, look at that. <coughs> he just came in from the paddock and he is registering at, if I can get it to stay on him, there, Tommy's holding it, 170, 180, that is, oh, there, touch it, good, 190, he is registering high chaos. Now, we're going to get our grounding stuff. This is what is going on while his voltage is so high. Looks like quite a bit of chaos. These horses all galloping around. Those are his friends. He just came in and they're angry he left. So this, all this energy could be creating some of that positive charge in the horse. Let's see if we can help change it. <laughs> all right, this is not his best angle, but we have now got the copper sheet which is just a piece of copper Faraday fabric, copper fabric on Waldo in the cross ties. This is just two pieces of copper fabric that my mother sewed together for me. It's a homemade sheet and Waldo is already looking calmer. We've got him plugged in to a grounding plug here that goes up into the wall. So Waldo has had his grounding sheet on now for I don't know, maybe three minutes, and he is looking a lot calmer. He was yawning a little bit. This just seems a whole lot better. I switched and put the green grounding plug, so we're keeping everything consistent. And now we're going to check his voltage. So Tommy's gonna take that. Okay, so can you see the thing? Yes. So look how much lo lower than he was before we put the grounding sheet on him. That is incredible. Thank you, sweetie. Okay, perfect. So we had to leave to go to Tommy's lesson but the end of the video definitely shows us that when we started, when Waldo first came in, he was up in the high, high 170s to 190, close to 200. And by the time we finished, which was probably a maximum of five minutes, he was down well below 100, well below 50, consistently well below 50. So it helps us see how this grounding sheet can really help lower that chaos in a hurry, in real time. And if you bring your horse in and it is like, ah, and you want to ride, throwing that grounding sheet on while you're grooming it could really help you have a much better ride that day than if you don't.